So let's look at an example of continuous query processing in action. Uh, here you can see moving data being emitted from a connected car, actually a Formula One racing car. And we could see the continuous query processor with Spotfire 10 um, displaying that information in real time. Now, what's really interesting is we're performing some real-time analytics. The size of those green dots are the, the, the rate at which the engine's revving. Those small red dots are actually how hard uh, the driver's braking. So by looking at this information continuously, a race car strategist can understand uh, information about the data as it's flowing. He can see the relationship between what the driver's doing and how the car's performing. He can maybe even overlay the competition to see if um, he's uh, got an optimal place to, 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 to pass. So this ability to live look at streaming data is very different than anything that you could ever do with snapshots, which would just give you maybe a couple images along the way, but you can now see the whole thing in motion.